is the people of Brazil saying, we don't want that. We don't want to become what's happened to these other Latin American countries that have fallen in this, like Venezuela, like Cuba, right? Did like Bolivia. See, do you ahead, see sir. in that image when she hands the flower and the flag, the sentry who is guarding at the front gate of this military inst installation, he salutes her. The poetic imagery of that is the military works for the people. The de most defenseless, a seven-year-old girl, he salutes her, and that's saying, I work for you. I work for the Brazilian people. I'm here to defend Brazil from threats, foreign and domestic. I'm here to defend Brazilian sovereignty. And this is very important because Bolsonaro, if he takes action, which I think he will take for action, the site, what will be cited in the Brazilian Constitution is Article 142 that says the military is the stabilizing institution of society. Given their history, this is how they structured the Constitution. And it's built around this, their slogan, order and progresso, order and progress, and that the military is built on hierarchy, discipline, and order. The constitutionalists like Bolsonaro are about rule of law, not mob rule like the Marxists, like Lula, who's going to yeah. let the prisoners out of jail and threaten the lives of the police, which is why the police will be yeah. joining in on this, and yeah. they have already.